Step 15. Add an image source folder with the second image dataset into a new project. In the Workflow tab, click the Image button in the Add Imagery part, to add images from the second dataset. Mark all images and click the Open button to load them. Step 16. Align the images. Change the 3D view. In the Alignment tab, click the Align Images button in the Registration part, to align source images. Change the 3D view using the mouse movement. Hold the left mouse button to move and the right mouse button to rotate the scene. Step 17. Check the application coordinate systems. Pay attention to project output. Import camera poses. Pay attention to file format coordinate system in the import flight log window. Export panel settings from the import flight log window. Hint. Possible usage with CLI import flight log command. Update. Change the 3D view. In the Workflow tab, click the Settings button in the Application part. Check Project and Output Coordinate Systems. In the Workflow tab, click the Flight Log button in the Import and Metadata part, to import camera poses. Choose the before exported file and click the open button to load camera poses. In the import flight log window, set a suitable file format and coordinate system in which camera poses had been exported. Click the export panel settings and export button, to export the panel settings from the import flight log window. Write a file name and click the save button. In the Alignment tab, click the Update button in the Constraints part, to apply the imported camera poses. Change the 3D view to see the perform changes better. Step 18 Import a Reconstruction Region In the Reconstruction tab, Click the Reconstruction region in the Import part, to import a region. Choose the before exported file and click the Open button to load it. Use a top, side and front view pressing number 2, 5 and 0 on your keyboard to check whether the region fits. Step 19. Create a 3D model in normal quality. In the Reconstruction tab, Click the Normal Detail button in the Process part, to reconstruct a 3D model in normal quality. In the 1DS, there will be added a newly created Model 1 under the Component 0. Step 20. Simplify the model to 1 million triangles. In the Reconstruction tab, click the Simplify Tool button in the Tools part, to simplify the 3D model. Set the target triangles count to 1 million and click the button to simplify. In the 1DS, there will be added a simplified model 2 under the component 0. Step 21 Save the project. Close the application. Click on the Reality Capture logo in the top left corner to open the main menu. Choose Save As. Write a file name and click the Save button to save your project. Click the button in the top right corner to close the application. Step 22. Clear the application cache. In the Workflow tab, click the Settings button in the Application part. In the Application Settings panel click the Clear button to clear the application cache. Step 23. Replace the used images in the source folder. Replace the used images in the image source folder using for example Total Commander. Open your image source folder and delete all used images.
Open the folder with images for texturing. Copy all of them into your image source folder. Step 24. Open the last saved project, source images are replaced. Change the 3D view. Click on the Reality Capture logo in the top left corner, to open the main menu. Click Open. Choose the last saved project and click the Open button to load the project. Change the 3D view using mouse movement. Hold the left mouse button to move and the right mouse button to rotate the scene. Step 25. Texture the simplified model. In the Reconstruction tab, click the Texture button in the Process part, to texture the simplified 3D model. In the 1DS, there will be a textured model 2 under the component 0. Step 26. Export the textured model. Pay attention to Coordinate System in the Export Model window. In the Reconstruction tab, click the Mesh button in the Export part, to export the 3D model. Write a file name and click the Save button. In the Export Model window, pay attention to the Coordinate System, which has to be set to the Project Output.